Peter Ridley, I'm just recording uh, Hunting the Narwhal for a piece of work that I'm doing at the moment. I just recorded that Hunting the Narwhal and to show on Wednesday after we've been on strike. Is that working okay? So, I mean, is this to do with your e teaching? E teaching? How uh, wonderful would your students feel if you said to them? Yes, stop I suppose right it is. You're doing a brilliant job on, the, it works on that cuff that. or on that shampoo. So, what do you think of the show so far? Show yeah. like Could be more interesting. Kind of <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty Absolute much a. Uh, so, what are you doing now? Are you going on I'm to your blog? I'm just going to. Yeah, I've just been on my blog. And I'm just going to try and see. Because the students are having difficulty understanding what the creature is and what they're trying to do. And I think this film shows them, even though the risk with this is it's a bit bloody. Yeah? So there's a risk that yeah, they might find it slightly offensive. But we've discussed hunting already, and the students understand that... Without this food, the Inuits wouldn't be able to live. We've got one girl who's called Karishma, who is a vegetarian and didn't really realise that there was no vegetation in the Arctic.